Now we're going to learn how to stream your music online through your tablet, phone, or PC for free. Stay tuned. All right, so now we're going to learn how to create our own streaming music from uh, from the cloud so that we'll be able to play our music from the cloud, whether it be on our cell phone or whether it be on our tablet. Um, and in this particular case, I'm going to show you on my tablet uh, how to download the app. It's called Cloud Beats. Um, and if you just click on your Google Play, uh, you'll be able to find Cloud Beats uh, on the store. You just type in uh, Cloud Beats and you'll see it come up there. It's got the little headphones with the cloud in between. It is free. Uh, there is some in-app purchases, but it's a, it's a free um, uh, free music player. You'll just go ahead and hit install, which I've actually already installed it on my system. So I'm just gonna click open here and you'll see Cloud Beats open up. And it'll open right up to files where it has a cloud. It says add cloud. It's got playlists over here on the side, uh, which obviously there's no songs or anything there. Artists, uh, well, there's a Samsung thing in there that are pulled in from Samsung, and there's albums and genres, but really you won't see anything in this because there's no place for it to find any music. So what we want to do is we want to have it find the music on the cloud that we just uploaded in the previous video where we learned how to upload music to, um, to our Google Drive to be able to access it from the cloud. So we're going to point it to that. So we're going to add to the cloud. We're going to, as you can see here, uh, Cloud Beats allows you to choose from a lot of different cloud sources. You've got Dropbox, Google Drive, uh, NextCloud, WebDev, uh, where you can have your own server, pull it from there, um, OneDrive, or Box, or pCloud. Uh, we uploaded it to Google Drive. It gave me a little bit more space, and, uh, and it's free also, just as some of these others are. If you choose Google Drive there, you'll have to choose the account that you want and uh, you'll need to give it permissions to be able to log in. It'll, it'll pull those up. It needs to have the permissions to be able to see your files. You're gonna click on Google Drive here and you'll see there's that music folder that we made in the previous video. Now in that music folder, we should see that Garth Brooks CD that we uploaded. So we've got a Garth Brooks folder. The CD is Rope in the Wind and look, there's all of our music. We see it right there. Now, I can, in, I can input these one at a time, but really what I want is I want it set up so that anytime I upload music to that music folder, that Cloud Beats will see it so that I don't have to keep going in here and having it look because it'll look automatically if it knows to look in a folder. So I'm going to have it just find that folder. And we're going to hit the uh, scan, the little three dots over in the corner, and we're going to hit scan and add to library. And it should pull that right in, and we should be able to see some Garth Brooks in there. Let's see here what we've got. See, there we go. We've got the Garth Brooks, uh, that's the artist. So we've got artists there. Um, we've got the album. So it shows it over here, Rope in the Wind is the album. If you click on the uh, songs in here, you'll see there they all are. So you can choose your album. And here's what's really neat about it. You can go to playlists, and you can add a playlist. So you add a playlist like Country and you hit OK. If you go over here to Albums, you can find the album that you want. You say, OK, I want to I want to add uh, Rodeo to your playlist. You just click the little three dots next to the uh, time button and you hit Add to Playlist and you can add it to the playlist that you want to add it to. And if you go back over, you will see in the playlist section that there's one song in our country playlist and it's that one right there. So if you want to play the songs, it's very easy to play the songs. You just uh, just hit the play button. Okay, you just uh, it's pretty easy. You just tap on it and start playing. If you want to mix them, you hit the hit the shuffle button down in the bottom right corner, and it'll shuffle them around. Um, it's uh, it's really a great feature to have, and uh, Cloud Beats makes it very easy. It's a very simple player. I mean, it's not going to be very complicated for you. And as long as you have it pointed to that music folder, anything that you upload to that music folder should automatically get added to your Cloud Beats app on your phone or on your tablet. And you can play this off of your 4G or 5G connectivity, or you can play it off of your Wi-Fi. It just makes it really easy. So um, thank you for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.